TMR again. People who know Mr. Vegas for years, you will understand that I am a strong advocate against these predators. As a matter of fact, I don't like them. I nearly dirt one of them, you know. I almost dirt one of them. Because he's a secondary victim, you know. Meaning, say, somebody we me related to, close to, love, got molested. So he's a secondary victim. And secondary victims, they do hurt too. So I don't like predators. However, me still leave room for a person to get due process. So I don't just jump up and ask me here, people, and say somebody do something. Or if somebody get arrested, me run out and say the person for dead. No. I believe in a due process. I want to see the evidence. Yeah. In this case with CMR, I have heard enough. And based on the police report, I want to tell you, CMR, say you're sick. I mean, I say you're sick based on just the police report. May I tell you, say you're sick based on what you tell me. Yeah. You see, as a father, brother, me can't protect a predator. You see, as a father, me can't protect a child molester. Me love me picking them too much, brother. Me have a daughter, 10 years old. And me have a son, 10 years old. <laughs> and me have other children. But them, they are the little one, them. So when we look at a 10-year-old little girl, she's not far from a 12 or a 13-year-old little girl. Yeah. So anybody will violate a 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, whatever age, and child's innocence. Once you violate a child's innocence, you're sick, brother. Baby that, brother. Now, the reason I'm even come out come come say, do process, because I still leave room for do process, no matter how me feel, because as a person with matriculated in the field of sociology, I have to deal with things objectively. You see? But with your situation, the reason why, I have to let it be known, so you're sick, is because you're not only a monster, in my view, in my understanding, in my thoughts, you're a pathological liar. Yeah. And it hurt me for no so I said that before your trial even start if it get to that. But whether you go to trial, yes or no, you are a pathological liar. Whether you're found guilty, them find you guilty, yes or no, you are a pathological liar. Based on the police report and where you tell me. What you told me and what is in the police report, and you spoke to me so convincing, and me as a father felt obligated to go and protect your stepdaughter. Because the people have put our picture all over the internet. We also have a family thing and everybody knew our face. So I felt as a father that I must go out there and tell them, say, it's not your stepdaughter. Because you told me it's not your stepdaughter. You told me it's somebody that come sleep over your house. You told me it's a Trini lady 
daughter. Come sleep over. So right they say click to me, say, me no want my picnic go sleep on nobody yard, you know. One, me not sure how I go on, me not know how I go on, and two, me no want nobody accuse me of anything. But I know that the police report I said, brother. You see, the little girl, the mother, reported to the police. I know that the police report I said. You say the mother is a trini. And the little girl sleep over your house. And you went to wake her up. And you touch her upon her shoulder and say, get up. Time for school. You told me that your stepdaughter was already up playing with her iPad on the bed. You told me that your wife had to download the footage then that you had to show that you are innocent and take it to the court. And that is how you got bail. You told me that they didn't even put a bangle on you. They never put no money tap on you, no bracelet, excuse me. Because the judge said, why is it that the mother is saying one thing and the child is saying something else? You said the child say. So you tell me now. You said the child say to the court or uh, in her report that she never said you touch her upon her breast. And the mother says so. You're a very dangerous brother if what this police report is saying is what actually the child reported. And the reason I feel obligated to do this is because I don't protect predators, brother. And I want whosoever involved to see this, to make them know that you are a liar. And they can take my phone for forensic if they need it. Because I don't like predators, brother. What in the report? bothers me so much when I not sleep last night. Yeah. And the fact that she had to go to the school or somebody outside of the home to make a complaint about you, it's telling. The report said you pulled down her pants. The report said this happened three times. You are grooming her if this is the, ca if the case. But it's contradictory to what you told me. So where is the Trini mother, CMR? Where is the girl that sleep over CMR? As a father, you send me, you give me your information and it clicked in, said, no, me must go protect this little girl. Because I don't mean, want she there at school or they're out there and people say she, she get, you know, molested by her stepdaddy. So of course, I go if it stop that bleeding there. But you open up more wounds because you're sick. If this police record is really what happened, and I get it from a legitimate site. You're crazy, brother. You need help, brother. A baby that, brother. And I can't believe you. Say so nothing no go so, or nothing no go on. Why? Because you lied to me, bro. Remember, say anybody for you, say nothing to me, you know. I just text you and say, brother, where this? This no look good. That's all I said to you, you know. You never feel me say nothing to me. Me even say to you, say, remember, say, this can be used against you in a court of law. So me I make you know, say, me they have to protect you if I, something really goes so if something really goes so. But as a father, I felt obligated to protect that little girl. But you open up more wounds. So the beaten way I get, 
it will get worse. Because I want the world to know that you are a liar. You are a sick, sick person based on the police report. Because we still have to leave that little 1% there. Eh? Say I know the police report that. But if that are the police report, brother, then if you go to prison, why? Because you're no longer credible. Yeah. You're sick, bro. You are sick. I want your wife and your family them way. Would I want to protect you? No, sir. Me not no reason for me to come up for you. Then for you understand, sir, then can't defend you against a child. Because you're a liar. You don't have no credibility. Yeah.